Welcome. In front of me is a Nubia Neo, and today I will show you how we can record screen on this device. So to get started, you want to pull down your notifications by swiping down from the top of your screen, and then swipe down once again to extend the list of toggles. Here you will find a screen recording toggle on one of the pages. For me it is visible on the first page, but if you don't see it on the first one, you can swipe to the left, and this will show you additional pages. Once you see this toggle, simply tap on it. It will bring up an overlay with the record button, microphone, and also to close this. Now on the microphone, there we go. Let's actually manage to click it correctly. Uh, you have a couple options. You have mute, mic, or system sound. So you can choose if you want to record, uh, for instance, no audio, microphone only, or system sound only. I'm just going to select system sound, even though there won't be anything playing. That's probably usually the better option. And from here, press on the record button. This will show you a counter on how long you've been recording. And from now on, whatever you do will be recorded by the device. Now there is a little bit of a caveat to it. So if you open up some kind of application that isn't supported by this, uh, the screen recorder will just record a black screen. Anyway, once you're done recording, you can click on the square. And this will automatically save your screen recording to your photos application. Here we can navigate to library and screenshots and you can see in the moment our screen recording. So I'm going to play it back. Now going back to what I was saying, uh, there are certain applications that have the ability to block the screen recorder and what you'll end up with is a black screen. Now this feature is implemented into Android for security purposes. So for instance, applications like Bank Apps uh, have some security from being kind of like spied on by some malware. So uh, some malicious uh, person wouldn't be able to gain access to like your bank information. But this is primarily also used uh, in a less uh, protective manner and more of a greed purpose, which is uh, used by, for instance, Hulu, Netflix, and any kind of other application that provides you any kind of service that they wouldn't want you to have easy access to. And what you end up if you try to open up Netflix, not even record a show, just open up Netflix with the screen recorder, and it's just a fully black screen. Obviously, um, at that point, you haven't really agreed to any terms of service, so it's kind of sketchy uh, that they can do that right away. Um, and obviously, additional uh, kind of downside is you have no control over that, which, in my opinion, is a massive uh, a no no. Like, we should, as a user of your phone, should have access to change the settings on an up to up basis. But just know that if you encounter this at this time and for a long time, we have no option to turn that off. Now, anyway, with that being said, hopefully you found this very helpful. And if you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.